On August 17, 2012, James Christopher Hickey put his two children, ages four and five, to bed around 8 p.m. His five-year-old son lived on the autism spectrum and wore diapers due to incontinence. Sometime during the night, the two children climbed out of their bedroom window as their dad slept. A passing motorist found the two children playing in the street the following morning. The motorist alerted authorities. The five-year-old's diaper was heavily soiled, as at least 14 hours had passed since Hickey had last changed him. This led the sheriff's deputy to charge Hickey with child neglect and mistreatment. When later questioned by a prosecutor, the deputies described what they observed, at length. Hickey was convicted on all three charges after a four-day trial. He was sentenced to two years in prison. An Oregon appeals court later overturned Hickey's conviction of child mistreatment, stating evidence of a single untimely diaper change was not sufficient to allow a jury to find Hickey had not protected the child from future bodily harm. The two counts of second-degree child neglect stood, and Hickey served his two years in prison.